Hello. The next common type of question you can expect is what are the different types of IAM policies we have. Now, what are your policies? Your policies are simply your JSON documents and uh, these policies, they simply define the permissions for the user account. So, what are the IAM users that we are creating? What these users can do when they log into the AWS account? That permissions can be defined by making use of your IAM policy. So, this simply defines the actions that an IAM user can take whenever they log into my AWS account. So, let's say for example, I will create all of you as a user in my AWS account. One. Now, when you log into my AWS account, what actions you can take, what you can do in my AWS account, I can control that by making use of your IAM policies. Now, generally, when we talk about your IAM policies, we can divide this into two types. We have the managed policies and then we have the inline policies. These are the two types we have whenever we talk about your IAM policies. Again, your managed policies can be divided into two types. We have the AWS managed policies and then we have the customer managed policies. So AWS managed policies are the policies that are uh, created and managed by AWS and then you'll have the customer managed policies. So any policies that we create are known as your customer managed policies and we will be responsible for managing those policies. So we'll have two types, the managed policies and the inline policies.